Hello ladies and gentlemen and welcome to my Europa Universalis 4 Let's Play as Taungu. Um We have abused the coalition mechanics to get into a war with Atze immediately after piecing out with them. Um, so now we can basically annex the entirety of Atze in about 10 years at the with the, uh, the low low cost of having to fight Ming because they're also in the coalition. But nevertheless um, let us fight. This won't take long. They only have... oh my... it's a lot of troops. No matter. More dead men. Actually... Um, take ten dudes... down... to what say... more than ten actually. Take the whole lot. Twenty-three? No, 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 no. No, no. I'll take you down to Atse and I'll take these guys to fight me because I I can blockade Atse they won't put up a fight I mean and then I, then I so I won't Brunei won't be able to land troops in fact how many transports does Brunei have you have s two <laughs> two transports and there they are let's try and sink them you're gonna get to the South China Sea on the 21st of February we're gonna beat you there uh, hello there we go now, Korea's landing forces. I do not give two dams about Korea. Very keen on thing though. Let's spread out a bit. Loot some, loot some land. Acquire some dosh. Uh oh. Ming. No, 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 no. You can't, you can't reinforce. That would be awkward. There we go. We lost three trade ships. Nevertheless, 26th of March, they cannot catch us because we are fast. We only have trade ships in our fleet. Let's pick off these Ming. Ooh, hello. Oh, you had to. There's no, there's no leader here. No. Oh. You actually going to attack me? No. I'm going to attack you though. 10th of April. We might get there in time. Send these guys around. You guys up here. We'll see what happens. This won't be a resounding defeat for them, but if we catch them, they'll lose. Uh, and they'll run up north, and maybe we can block them off. Yeah, you're just staying there to blockade. Uh, let's repair. Nope. Up this way. Now that Brunei does ha has no fleet, they cannot get off their island, so they're just... They're nothing. Pointless. I did declare on them, though, so the, the cause's belly is to fight them, is to take one of their provinces, so I probably will land some troops there at the end of this war. Stop running away, you pathetic cowards. Just go to Hanyang, loot some stuff. Oh, I need more forces. Oh, we caught them. Oh, hello, we're going to catch you two. 13th of May, four oh. Well, you're moving in here. So you'll stop, then we can move in. Come on, come on. We will not be able to reinforce these fools, but, uh... Good luck. They're gonna lose anyways. Oh, ow! What was that? That was us rolling poorly. They have no discipline and they're going to win. And they got away! Ah! No, no! Can we catch them? 2nd of June, 20th. Yes, we can. This is awkward. I really didn't think we'd lose this. Oh, no! Z, you failed me! Well, here we go. Consolation prize. We stack wiped 10,000 peasant soldiers of Ming. Right, we did lose that, but we'll go and we'll take our vengeance. I guess moving away from Ming was a bit premature. We still have these guys around here. We'll just leave them on the capital for now, I think. Yeah. Yeah. 
Now that we have a quality general, this fight will be embarrassingly one-sided. If we can reach... Diplomats, diplomats, diplomats. Let's make the Ayurat Horde like us a bit. Oh, we need to prepare our next war, which will be against Bengal, I suspect, because there's really very little else for us to fight. So let's start making claims on them. Come on, come on. There we go. 2nd of August, 20... Ha <laughs> ha It is 2 to 1 against, so maybe I shouldn't be counting my chickens. Why am I sieging Nanjing? What's going on here? We should still win this. I said that about the last fight, but this time we have a really good general in charge. And we have better military tactics, and they have no discipline. So, yeah, sit down. <laughs> oh. That's better. Smoosh. Let's just kill these guys. Let's chase them. Hopefully somebody, some opportunist will declare on them. Just, when does your truce with Ming run out? Two years. And yours in f six years. So really, we, we don't have any friends to help us. We are friendless! Wait, no, 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 no. This way. You this way. You need to Guilin. Now you're going down south. 11th, 14th, we'll catch you, we'll kill you. Stack wipe! Constantly has peasants. Why? You have no revolt risk. I guess it's from events. We've lost the siege of Utsang, Nepal, you villains. Uh, yeah, more nationalists. I don't care. They're like a, like a pretty much a block from Archer. Right. More Ming crushed under my boot. Um, what now? What indeed? We have guys down here. Um, Joe is not joining us, unfortunately. I would like to be f defeat these Korean pesky bastards. There we go, they have joined us. Problem is, if we use their... I don't want to use their military f s tactics, because Korea is ahead of Z... of Joe, I mean. Mm, do I want to hire a general? Do not like my air. Do I hire a general? 50 military power. That would send me back too much. The answer to that is no. Um, let's find these wretched Ming soldiers and deal them a hammer blow. There we go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We're lacking their soldiers in Pahang. I'll leave them there for now. Because they are a counter. Counterweights to, um, I'd say. Right. What I'm gonna do. Are you actually gonna. 29th. Haha, I'm gonna beat you there, I'm gonna kill you. I'm gonna kind of hopefully try and wait for, um, prevent Mink from moving off Jinan until I can get my entire army there just to stack wipe them. Stack wipe the bastards. And then that'll be that. How much. How, what is Ming's army like? It should be more than this. Hmm? They only have 16,000. So they have 8,000 running, running about here like headless chickens, but. big deal. They also have no manpower, if I read that correctly. Nope. And they lost the mandate of heaven. So. Oh, they got it back. Bah! bah. Let's go. Let's kill them all. This will be like shooting fish in a barrel. Literally. Well, not literally. Metaphorically. Ho 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 ho! And that was that. Now we'll go back and deal with these pesky fools on my borders. Don't want to take the same route to avoid um, attrition. And let's split this army up. Let's split it into... Yeah, I think that's that's much better. <laughs> Bit of a sneaky trick. Sneaky little trick! 
Now we uh, just lower it off to move our general over here so we can fight Korea. Mm. Oh, this looks very sad. Pavel, do not like. Of course, they have level 1 forts all over the place, so it me out with relative ease. Strong military. Oh, I hate this event. We can lose stability or we can lose army tradition. Oh. Now would be a really good time to hire a general. Like, a really good time. Before we lose this army tradition. I think it is. Oh, it's so much military power! Oh! Ah! No, 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 no. I can't do it. I'm so far behind in military tech. I need to catch up desperately. And why aren't you moving? Get out of here. This is a bit of a hotbed of trouble. Ow. Ooh, you have a good general. Puts us at a... Well, we're basically even, but we have more men. So it's just luck of the roll. Slice. Slice and dice. Now, let us retreat one province, because they can't run all the way back to Korea, because Korea's too far away. Right, I think now that most of the trouble is dealt with, I'm going to leave my vassals to their own devices. Oh, whoa, whoa. No, I do not want to interfere with the peasants. Um, I could fight Nepal. Or I could just leave them alone. What I will do, actually... Take these guys out. Ming's new army. Problem with fighting Ming, it's a bit like whack-a-mole. Every time you kill their stuff, more just pop up. Of course, we're not looting... Oh, hang on. Merc number one. Merc number two. We are really losing out on so much dosh by not looting Ming. Merc number three. Go and make yourselves useful. Actually, forget that. Attach, please. I actually do need you. You're not looted, are you? Neither are you. Neither are you. There we go. We'll start from there. Where are you going? Luang Prabang on the 14th of April. Suits me. I'll meet you there on the 13th. Actually, you know what? I'm not, I'm, I'm going to... Where are you going now? Tahek. No, you're not. I'm going to just bait you. Not bait you, but kind of faint them so they cannot get off this province. That way uh, I can wait till the bulk of my army gets there and we can stack work with them. Money, 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 money. Money, money, money. So much money. Uh, is Guanzhou looted? No. No, no. Wing. Just go away. Stay there. Sit down. Right. You need a Korat. I don't think you are. Oh, I... <laughs> 23rd of May. Yeah, this is a bit, a bit annoying, but 15 versus 9, I probably won't stack wipe them. Uh, and that'll be unfortunate. Move you to Fuzu. Move you to whatever this place is. Get some more money. Right, Korea will go drop like flies. They don't even have a general, but neither do I. Chiang Rai? I don't think so. Vientiane? Uh, 6th of June. I can wait a couple of days. There we go. Stop it.
Need more money. More money, more problems. Rebels are successful. Quite a lot of rebels. That is that is a lot. And Atse is there too. Maybe the rebels will fight Atse? Probably not. No. There we go, finally. Um they're only gonna move one province, so hang on. Get out of my land. That should deal with them. We can make these guys go down to none. You're gonna go to Chiang Mai. Oh no, I don't think you are. Nope. Long Prabang. No, no, no. Sukatai. First of July. I will not catch them. That's the part of the goal. Damn it. Our morale ticks, so we might not f wipe them off the face of the earth just yet. More money, please. Now, we're very close to getting all of our forces ready to fight Ming. There we go. Stack wipe. Stack wipe. Let's get around to here. Fight the rest of these Korean landing forces. Bengal. We got a claim. Let's make another one. We lost the siege of Parak. That's more nationalist waffle. Do not care. We're going to get to Chiang Mai in six days and then we can stop them getting to Pegu. We'll get to Nan on the 25th of July. There is only one way for you to go and that is south. I think this is it. Finally, we've baited them and I really bloody well hope we stag them after all this effort. 15th of August 14th of August, so... Wait one day. There we go, they arrive on the same day, all 29,000 of my regiments. Bearing down to crush the Ming. Please stack wipe. To... <laughs> right, let's go down south. I think it's time to accept the demands of these nationalists, don't you? It's getting a little intense. 25,000 of them. Wait, 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 what's going on here? I guess you can follow behind so I don't lose attrition. Uh, I'll leave this six to kind of run around here and try and stop Ming from interfering too much. It's still got a lot of stuff kicking around, <coughs> all of them combined, but um, it's all very separated, so that's good. Good for me. Right, armies, Ming, what have you got? What have you got? Ming, 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 5,000. <laughs> there we go. The, uh, the Ming are crushed. Let's get a guy back from the Oirat Horde. The Oirat Horde and I, we're really good friends. We are allied. Um, they fought a war with us uh, against Ming, but they they don't know who we are. But apparently we're really cool. Right, so I've forgotten about you guys. So much money. You're not looted. Your base tax. Ooh, no, wait, wait. Base tax 10. Mm, money, money, money. Bit of micromanagement involved with this. I'll move to Kelantan, but I kind of just need my diplomat. Wait, I don't need a diplomat to accept the demands of rebels. Sorry, bit of a brain fart there. Malacan nationalists accept the demands. Lose some prestige, but we'll, we can get that back from slaughtering Atse. Let's go and blockade the Straits of Johor so they have nowhere to run. I don't think Ming will run, Ming will run to engage me, although I could be wrong. Now, more looting, more treasure, please. Go here. 
go here. I've not looted the capital. You can go... Oh dear. Down here. No, down here. I'm just looking at the trade map mode because it shows a little icon if you've looted a province. Now. What do I do? I have a free diplomat. Uh, yeah, yeah. Can make Golconda like me a little. I can make the Timurids like me. As soon as actually, yeah, that's very important. As soon, well, I'll wait till to wait for a bit here. As soon as the Timurids discover I exist, they will probably join the coalition against me because they have so much aggressive expansion against me. Where are you going? Come here. Now. Nearly there. None of the Ming's forces are moving to block the straits. Good, good, good. You can go north. You can go south. And you're a bit screwed. Where are you going to go? We'll take you east, west. Mm, now. Uh-oh, you're going to attack me. No, you're going to the Mekong Delta. Good. Um, 5th of December. 2nd, so we'll wait three days. One, two, three. Boom! They are so toast. Now, as long as the big Ming Navy isn't, doesn't on, isn't on the move, I can blockade the Straits of Johor with impunity. I'm also going to have to deal with Brunei's army eventually. This is going to be a long war. Right, could I leave that province? Yes. I don't have military access with Manchu. But I do with Irats, do I? Yeah. So I can't loot that stuff. You go to Guangzhou. Guangzhou. Wonderful. Everything's... Oh, stack wipe. Stack wipe! Now. What are the garrisons like here? Oh, less than a thousand. Wait a day. Oh, wait. There we go. So, let's actually just merge because my manpower is toast. Take this guy and kill him. Bye bye. Send one guy to Johor. Send another to Siak. Send a third to Palembang. You tech one or two. You'll tech one. So I will send a thousand people to that little island. Um, send two thousand to Aru. Aru? Nope, just one thousand. Send the other thousand to this place. What, where are the level 2 forts? Just the capital. Right, so we need Lampung and Benkolan. Uh, I don't think I've done this right. No, there we go. Um, that's a... Right, we'll send the rest to sit on Palembang because I'm going to have to move some stuff into Brunei, unfortunately, to deal with the fact that the war goal is in Brunei. They have 12,000. Tech 7. F fuggles. We're nowhere near. Oh, look. Hello. Haha. -ha. Next. Right, looting. Loot! Pillage! Guangzhou is quite rich. That's ten gold. Ten ducats! And you can go to Luzo. That's only four ducats. And you're still moving. There we go. Koch nationalists. Guess who we're accepting demands from? Ouch. Ow, 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 ow. Do not like this loss of manpower. We 
Which one's richer? None of them, they're all the same. Just keep wiping out the Ming. Where's my big army? <gasps> Attrition! No, no. Can't even consolidate. We have 10 ships. So you will send... 10 of our finest to fight in Sukan, 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 whatever that place is. Hopefully Brunei will leave us alone and won't contest the landing because of our good general. They'll be fearful of losing. We have no point in... let's make these people our vassals not attached because they are wasted here. This is quite the war. We're going to get some outrageous war exhaustion from it. Hmm. When did it start? Probably a couple of years from... Three years. Uh. It's going to be many more years to come. We're going to occupy the whole of Ming to get what we want. Kitchan on the 7th, so we'll move in on the 6th. Good, good. Yeah, it looks like Brunei is leaving us alone. I am pleased. Our manpower, though, it's garbage. Can't even. Yeah. Our reinforcements are pretty low, which is a saving grace. I'm content just leaving the Brunei army alone for now, because, um... There we go, stack wipe. Because... Let's do something sneaky, let's try and take the Nepalese capital. Blop. My plan is, if I conquer Nepal's provinces, they'll be too poor to afford a large army, and they'll have to disband. Right, let's loot some more. Speaking of poverty, let's avoid that. See, even though we're making, we're losing ducat, we're losing ten ducats a month in our treasury uh, from our balance sheet, but we're actually gaining money every month just because we are looting so much stuff from Ming. It's the entire reason why we can pay the, fight this war. I think getting rid of Artsy in this war, even though it's we've gone to quite quite the effort to do it, just because it gets one more person out of the coalition. Right, we can tick up our admin. Um, what do we get from this? Nothing. But it's important we do it. Or we can wait. Till that dick dings to 20. Maybe. Might happen. What are you doing? Oh, stupid vassals. Go away. This is level 2 fort. Hmm. Somewhere in this Brunei land is an army of 12,000. Te Wait a minute, you were tech 7 before, now you're tech 8? What? We're only tech 6. I think we're going to leave them alone. We're just going to take our war goal. Oh, it's which is this place. Whatever, we'll just... We'll go here. That's outrageous. That gives some extra tactics on us. Gives us point for extra tactics. We cannot fight Brunei's forces. Not with this little army. Little army. Take you men. No. Don't want to. Uh, wow. Our land is swarming with enemies. You go to Fuzu. And you... Wait, wait, where am I? You go to there. Shame we can't loot Jinan. It's very rich. Oh, we can. Oh, I thought it was bordering, bordering the Oirat horde, but it's not.
Right, well, this is a bit of an eye of the storm situation. Once, we, once this is all taken, we can take these units and do something with them. We could hire some more mercs. Oh, I can't loot this place, it's adjacent to my land. All of this stuff is. This, yeah. You looted? Nope. I think I'm gonna hire some mercs just to turf these people off my land. Then I'll get rid of them. One, two, three, four. That'll do. Wait, I can call. Oh, of course, I can call land. It's all that stuff I took from Atze. Wow, you took some stuff from Timmy's. Level two forts. I'd I'd like to leave this relatively well defended here, so that we take it. Which, that being said, I can afford. They only have 6,000 dudes, and we're in mountains, so actually, I think we can afford to do this. We'll see. Oh, we busted the walls down, that's brilliant. In fact, I'm gonna blockade. I would very much like to take Brunei and provinces, because the more land we take, the smaller their army is going to become, because they won't be able to afford the upkeep. Right. Money, money, money. Money, 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 money. The war score's not great. We've got 28 from battles, but we're not controlling the woggle. Oh my word. This is all getting a bit intense. Aha! Joe and Shan and Z, just the people. Korea entered an alliance with Ming. You already were in alliance with Ming, that's why you're fighting me. Hey, maybe Korea wants out. Because they're fighting Japan. They're the only ones I can separate peace. Yes! Our first siege that we've won! Brilliant. Of course, Marcus Ars is chilling. Because of the, the uh, damaged ships. Which I'm happy with. After this, we'll go for their capital, because they're chilling out in Sabah. Fact, what we're going to do is detach some transports. Ooh, whoa, 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 attrition. Uh, going to have to remember that. Cannot have all my ships dying. We'll take some, uh, any guys that win sieges, we'll ferry them to Brunei. Come on, win, 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 win. There we go. 21%. I'm going to try something. Hopefully Brunei will not attack us. Uh, if we put seven on each place, although I suspect they might. Bit of a gamble here. Bit of a gamble. Bit of a gamble. We got our claim there. What do we do with our diplomat? With our diplomat. More stuff on Bengal. Mine! Mine! Mine, mine, mine! Right. Boop! Let's go crack some skulls, yes? Where's our... Mm. No leader, but it doesn't matter. We're just killing peasant Chinese. We don't need a leader for, a leader for that. Mordosh! Where are we? Mordosh! Give me the cash. I was gonna make the Timmies like us. I forgot about that. We're close to this tech now. We need 916. Right, we won back some of our stuff. <gasps> oh, I didn't see that! Ah, no, no, no! I should have set the message settings. Combat. When one of our armies is attacked by the enemy, this type is a, a pop-up. I didn't get this message. Oh, we attacked into them because I'm a lummox. 
Right, can we retreat? Because that went horribly. We've lost we lost seven thousand dudes. Ugh. Ow. Ouch. That was that was so painful. We're gonna see if we can escape. You're gonna get there on the seventh of January. We're gonna get, yeah, we can we hopefully be able to escape. Yeah, we'll dock and leave before they can take back. That was terrible though, that was just gruesome. Well, when in doubt, higher mercs. We'll take six mercs to replace our losses. Of course, our uh, our maintenance is just unpleasant. Um, but we can save the day by acquiring some ducats from Ming. to Jahor. Where is the Jahor? Fourth of January. This is close. They're going to get there on the seventh. I think we're going to escape on the sixth. <laughs> uh oh. I really hope we make this. This is pretty much a coin flip. No. Oh, this is this is disastrous. We have just. I have just completely war weary population I'm not losing I'm not getting war exhaustion we're not gonna win this there's no way we're gonna get slaughtered because they're two techs ahead of us I mean you're not even gonna be able to retreat doesn't matter we're gone we are toast um so yeah that happened let's give in to the Assamese nationalists I really really dropped the ball there Shouldn't have split my army. That was so embarrassing. And yeah, they're just gonna run and try and attack us. Just, we can't can't run away. Can't do can't do anything. Goodbye. Right. So that happened. That was a thing. We just lost fourteen thousand army men. Um Where now? Go there. Ah. That was deeply embarrassing. Oh well. Mistakes were made. And now this garrison does just nothing there, so we've got to somehow try and relieve this. And I don't know how. Because we don't have any army to speak of. Well, we kind of do, but it's bit busy up here fighting okay no needs must get down here Z and Shun can Zo can Joe can do their own bloody thing just make sure that is none of these want our, uh, I don't want any of these checkbox units to say attached to this unit yeah so I don't know what they're doing stop attaching to me there we go Get out of here. That's nine, that's 10,000 units plus some mercs we're going to recruit. We'll be able to do this. We can do this. I think. Kind of. At the expense of mega war exhaustion. Ugh. Ugh. Can we take Bowding? Nope. Can't leave that. Uh, diplomat, diplomat. What can we? <laughs> who can we fabricate claims on? No one really. This is it. We can fabricate on Oirat, but I'm not going to do that. Bengal. We're doing already. Hmm. I'll make Majapahit like us. Ay ay ay. Yeah, you know, army maintenance isn't so high anymore because you know we lost our bloody army. Oh, it's unpleasant. Right, we want another siege, good. Get these fools over here. Let's try and uh 
blockade some stuff. Make these seeders go faster. And how are we for military power? Nearly there. At the end of the year we'll be able to have tech 7. It's pretty nice take 8. How did that happen? situation is not looking good. These sieges are going well though, against Nepal. And then we can get them out of the race. Where's my... Ah, oh, there you are. You go to there. Or there. No, you go there. No, wait, oh, no, 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 no. Wait, 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 wait. This isn't looted. You go here. Get some money. Get some gold. Right, we want more sieges. Uh, here. Right, so 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13,000 men. Plus these guys. I think we can do this. No cavalry, though. And they have a cannon. I actually have no cavalry to speak of. Ay, ay, ay. Where is my cav? I have one cavalry unit. <laughs> well. Why don't we... Where's my nearest core province? Patani. Let's make... a cav. Because I feel it's important. Just got to make sure they can't flank us by it, so and then the cavalry won't be that useful. Oh, don't attach here, really. We don't need you. Z and Zo, Joe, just do your own thing, please. Well, look at that. We took their capital, and <laughs> they can't afford most of their army, so it was all disbanded. Because uh, I bet they don't have a core here. Oh, they do, but it's base tax four, and Kathmandu is. Hmm. Man, they are poor. They had 6,000 men, now they have 1,000, 2,000. No matter. Um, while they're sieging, let's take the risk and move them to Sukadan? Sukapakapa? Move them here. Hopefully they won't, they won't engage because they're busy. Good. Damn you, Brunei. Right, so I'd say it's 100%ed, which is nice. <gasps> no, now you, no, you're not supposed to move. Oh, oh, you villain. How long will that take you? 20th of July. Let's move in. Let's use our ships. Oh, I kind of, I kind of buggered up here. Um, should I? I'm thinking I move into Banjamasin. Uh, just go straight in there and then reinforce. It'll take forever, but so will anything else we do. I mean, taking them in here like this will take uh, September. No, thank you. 10th of August. Can we survive? Almost set. Because their tech is so much better than mine. We can we retreat? 11th of August. Get out of here! Right, so we lost some men. Ha! <laughs> let's hire some mercs. I said let's hire some mercs. I really should have waited until the end of the year. So I had my my tech. Military tech. Ugh! So I have some pathetic reinforcements. Not enough for them to consider atta not attacking me there. Ay ay ay. Now. What do we do? Money. Need money. Need money. There we go. Get some ducats. Are they not attacking me? Am I going to survive this? 
I think I am. Yay! Now we'll survive. Man, oh man. Right. Let's continue to loot. It is the lifeblood of our nation. Um, Jung men we can't loot because it's it's uh, neck bordering us. Ay, ay, ay. Let's go to Nanjing. You can go to here. Yeah, well, that nope. Nope, can't go there. We can go there. There we go. More money. We've lost because his belly against our vessel. Woe is me. <laughs> we can't. Our one cavalry will come to the rescue. Ming? Oh, we must have caught one of their reinforcements. Goodbye. We lost the siege of Amda. That's something Nepal took from us, bastards. No, it's something Ming took from us. Where is the Nepal? Our vassals are clearing house. Z killed Nepal's army. Brilliant. Lost the siege to Korea. Korea, do you want to peace out? Nearly. Five. They will be very close to peacing out because they're being attacked by Japan. Right. How much of this is mercenaries? Oh, I can this is difficult to afford. Spoils of war. It's what's keeping us alive. Can we can we tick up yet? Next month. Wait, do we go north or south with you? South. No north. Looks like Joe and Z are kicking house. Kachar nationalists, I know what I'm going to do with you. I'm going to uh, negotiate. Might as well make. Oh, we can't make Makasa like me because we are at war. Manchu, whoa, you don't like me at all. Apparently, we're neighboring heretics, of course. Korea, your want to use at z zero. She come back from Manchu. We'll peace out Korea next month. Uh, let's take this one boat, one night. Finally, we can tech. And te we'll do. Should we do tech five? Not yet. Actually, I think we only. It was ten percent. Now we've got the fifteen percent. I think waiting is a bit of a fool's errand. Let's just check. Now if we look at the tech map, we are not doing well. Although we were dark red and now we're light red. So, <laughs> so we've moved up the scale slightly. Um give me money. I need money for my belly. So I can pay my mercenaries and win this wretched war, which has been going on for five years. And s right, I think it's now or never, really. These guys need to die. I could use my. Mm -hmm. I oh fuck it! Just kill them. Yes, they're trying to run away, which is a good sign. It means win. Although we're not going to get there in time. Okay, on the 13th, we'll... No, wait, no, screw this. Central Thai Patriots. Our nation is falling to pieces. What now? 2nd of March? Yeah, we've got you. Now, Korea. I don't like you. Go away. Please. They will not white peace. 22. They will not betray their ally for gold. We could, um... I c I'm content waiting. I don't want to give in to that. I don't want to concede defeat and lose 10 prestige needlessly. Right, this siege has been won. 
Um, once this seed is won, we'll move them and attack Ming up here. Right, here we go. Moment of reckoning. We've got a minus one terrain, but our general is much better than theirs. However, they have better military tech than us. But we do outnumber them two to one, so I'm confident this will be a reversal of fortunes. Whoa, 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 whoa. What's happening here? Ah, oh, we're going to kick their ass. Speaking of... There we go. So, Brunei is dealt with almost. Let's just continue looting. Loot, 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 loot. Loot up. Loot everything. For my belly. They're probably going to move all the way to Sabah. What's really interesting is if you if you choose um, to play this game on a later start date, 100, Brunei only occupies this one province and the rest of this is considered um, uncolonized land. Which I find a little peculiar. Maybe the uh, central administration receded, or something could maintain control over the island. Or maybe paradox is just oversimplifying things again. Now, merge because we have no manpower or money. And let's siege. Let's take our terrible vengeance out upon Brunei for causing us so much grief. Actually, let's take these guys out, and then we can move these fellows back to the mainland and clear house with them. And this guy can just die. Don't wanna don't wanna lose the manpower reinforcing him. And you can go and come back. Come home. A jet and peasants. I can live with that. Please can you finish your siege and can I finish looting? You, um. Yeah, that'll do. I have a guy up here. Let's just take a look at the ledger. I want to see something. I want to see my income. Compar income overview. Nope. Where is it? Cost. There should be a, a... Oh, there we go. Spoils of War. Last year, I got 144 gold from Spoils of War. Um, and I took a loan. <laughs> Good God. My uh, expenses... My balance is... At, but bleh, budget is only being balanced by the fact that I'm looting <laughs> hundreds of gold from Ming every year. And it's still not being balanced. I'm still losing money like, like nobody's business. Yay, we won the siege now. Kill Ming. And, ah, finally, Korea wants to white peace. Thank you. Good, good. So now it's just, uh... Nepal's out of the game. Atsai's out of the game. Brunei's out of the game. It's just Ming now. And Makassar. These numbers are a little unrealistic because Makassar has an army which is not being put to use. So Makassar is 7,000, but Ming is, Ming is 30,000 troops again. Well, it's a good thing we're getting our army back from Brunei, yes? Back to slaughter them. Like flies. Is Ming still tech 5? They are. We're two techs ahead. That's beautiful. I'm not scared about Ming if they have 30,000 units. Let's talk peace, because I want... What do I want? I want this. I want... Haiti. Oh, I've, this is going to cost me an arm and a leg in diplo points. Oh, well. What you going to do? Um, and... Yeah, that's it, really. Peace off a value of 80. Can I get some stuff for, uh, for Z? Something that's 19 more score would be good. Aha! Although it's a bit, a bit of an enclave, but I don't care about rebels. Um, and that will be, that'll be that. Or I could get young men for you, Joe. There, that's better. Um, Peace offer of a hundred. We're a little quite far away from that, but 
Now we just focus solidly on beating up Ming. Um, wait a minute, can't I just clear the offer? Can't I just demand Atze as a vassal? Yes, yes, that's much better. That'll be a lot less aggressive. That'll be a lot less diplo power. Uh, they'll hate me though. Aggressive expansion 168. Hmm. I'd say I would not trust Tongu to die properly. I can live with 168 aggressive expansion. Ah, oh, I can deal with that. Although if I had an Exum and release them, I could marry them because they'll be Buddhist. Oh, it's complicated. Don't know what to do. Looks like Z and Joe got killed by Ming. This is a lot of stuff, but we can deal. We can deal with it all. Loot some more stuff, please. No, free thinking leads away from God. Yeah, lose some change to confusion. I don't care. We've lost the siege. No. Right, we have an army. Well, we use it to hammer our foes into submission. That is all of Brunei. Yes, they don't have anything else. No. Good, good. Ay, ay, ay. Looks like, ooh, maybe I shouldn't. Let's get out of here. Let's meet up with the main force and then go stomping. Stompy, stompy, stompy. Then we can kill these fellows. Oh, we're losing money. Time to loot, time to loot. Uh, go to Hyun. I think we're doing a much better job of looting than we were at the start of the war. Who knows? Who cares? Let's just... Uh, let's just... Kill some Chinese forces and win the war. At least we have the war goal now. Central Thai Patriots have beaten us into submission. We can live with that. Hmm, our revolt risk is not good. It's not... It's very low. Hmm. A lot of that is Utsa land, though. Some of it's not, though. Kachar, for instance. Quite a bit of nationalism. Actually, let's all go to Chiang Rai and meet up. They're all grouping up, and so will we. I mean, we'll crush them. Hopefully, they won't tech up in that time. Although, they've been at technology level 5 for a long, long, long time. What's their king like? Good. Very good at military tech, but he's very young. So, they probably had a garbage king on the throne for a while. More peasants. Like I give a damn. I hear the clink of money coming into my coffers. Give me the dosh. Uh, more dosh, more dosh, more dosh. There we go. Keeping us solvent. Where are you going? You know, on the 18th, and we're going to get there on the 27th. Bah. Well, on the 17th, we'll move into Yunnan. We probably won't catch them because it's quite a long march from Yunnan to um, from this place to Yunnan. 3rd of January, 9th of January. Bagger. Kachar gains a core. And we won a siege, so Nepal is dealt with. We'll handle those Kachari nationalists. Boop. 
Mine of risk is through the roof. Or exhaustion. That was painful, but I had to do it. I mean, it's either that or being at peace for 20 years. That's, that's not something I'm going to tolerate. So I wasn't going to decay naturally. Protect against Ming. <laughs> sure. I can do that. I can do that by beating Ming's army down to, to, to the dust. Right. Incompetent diplomacy. Better relations over time. Minus 10%. I can live with that. Ooh, all of this stuff is looted. All of it's looted. What's not looted? And up here, nothing's looted. I mean, in the middle. This rich coastal land is ripe for the picking. Right, so we will crush them. Or not. Oh, god damn it! Just stop running away. 9th of February. Holy shit, his general's good. Six shock! How about we go here instead? Yes, I, I much prefer this state of affairs. Because they have no leader here. So good luck. Good luck fighting me off. You still tech 5? You are, and we're tech 7. In the forest, but it doesn't matter. <laughs> ah, and we protected against Ming. Through great laborious efforts, we've constructed an army that's larger than theirs. Now what can we do? Claim our rival's province, Gansu. I suspect that's owned by Ming. So we can't claim it during this war. Ba -ba -ba -ba. Yep. Nope, can't do that. No can do. Right, now you're running away to Wenshan. You're running away to Kwamdo. Can we meet? Can we... Oh, we can, we can catch you. Good. Good, good. I suspect Ming has no man to speak of. Nope. So once we kill this stuff, they'll be relying on mercs again. More money, please. Money for my coffers. Right, so they're going to be stack wiped. Are you... you're just chilling. Why don't you siege this land back? Now we go to fight this stack, which is going to be difficult because they have that six shock. And by difficult, mean I mean we probably won't stack wipe them. Actually, you go here. There we go. We want a siege! Yes! Good night. Hang on a minute. Ajatan peasants. Hey, I'd say I'd like to support real rebels. Pop. Pop. Oh, look. Look at that. Broken the sieges, have you? I wonder how that happened. Bug there that needs to be fixed. Six shock. You got lucky with that, General. Maybe their army tradition increased because we've been slapping them about so much. If you lose a battle, you gain quite a lot of army tradition. I think it's about five for a large battle. There we go. Oh, it doesn't matter. <laughs> oh, Ming, you're so weak. You're weak! Right, let's start sieging up now. Uh, let's just start taking their rich coastal land. Let's merge these looting units and take Nanjing. Actually, no, let's keep looting. It's really worthwhile. So much money. Can we take Shanxi? No. Borders the Irat Horde. Uh, might as well take our boats around to pick up these four units. 
And our manpower is recovering because we're not really losing any men. Young men, seven base stacks. I will take some dudes there. See, look at that. It's 9k and seven of that is from Makasa. They are, they are. Ming is toast. Let's use the mercs to siege. They can eat the attrition. Of course, once these sieges are through, it will limit our looting opportunities. But we can. We're just going to, to suffer through that. As unpleasant as it is. The downside, of course, is that. Um, this war is taking forever. Six years, and we've only just begun to siege down Ming. 7% war score. We only need about 20 more. If if that I'm still not sure what to do with Artsay. I really actually think I'm gonna annex and release just to make them Buddhist Buddhist. It will help me so much in the long run. Right. You need to Giang on the twelfth. <laughs> I will slaughter your cavalry with my mercenary. <laughs> You've grown fat off the land from looting and now you will pay your way. Actually two versus one. Oh. Now back, go back to looting. Change my mind. Think it might be worthwhile deleting some of these mercs now. Whatever's left in this stack. Blop. Oh, actually, that's quite a lot. Are these mercs? No. Any of you mercs? Yeah. I'll send. I'll replace the mercs with infantry there, and I will delete. Half of the mercs. Get rid of that outdated unit too. That spearman. Ooh, pins and needles on my foot again. Ow! 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 Excuse me. <clears throat> Do not like pins and needles. Right, so this war is... Hopefully I'll be able to bring it to a swift conclusion. Ming must have war exhaustion out the wazoo. Mm. Tell me your secrets. Uh, oh, only seven war exhaustion. That was less than me before I reduced it. Do we have... um? Can we set our focus, national focus yet? Another war. We have got 40 war score from battles, yes? Yes. All that stack wiping. Prey no core occupied by Ming. Minus 5 war score. Where's Prey no core? Oh, down there. Well, we better deal with that. Because I don't like the sound of that. Well, not one bit. Pop. Right, you can die. Pop. Actually, what I'll do is I'll send you guys to take out Prinacor. And you guys can go and siege Wenzhou. Actually, you can siege. Where's a 10 base tax province? I uh, can go siege Hangzhou. And you can loot more stuff. Pay your way. Ah, uh, you're worthy in the toilet. Minus twenty eight. What are you doing? Oh. You're from the ships. Let's 
It looks like Ming's trying to rustle up an army again. Let's fix that. Can we catch you? Glamy. Malayan Patriots again. You're trying to meet up in Sichuan. No, 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 no. We can't let that happen. Are you trying to attack me? No. More looting. More commandly. Right, so. Two versus three, but their defense is crap, and we have a good general. So, good night, sweet prince. We will discover supporting peasants in Atze. Doesn't matter. They are. Why are they objecting? Oh, they are. That is. That Atze, that little piece of land. That spit of land. Got some peasants in Brunei. Well, we'll do the same trick if they ever come close to winning the siege. Hey, we have money! Let's repay our loans. Oh, maybe that was a bit premature. Now we have no ducats. Quick, we must loot! We must save the treasury from collapse! Did we win a siege? Yeah, down here. Good. Brunei is fully occupied by my forces. We can send these four dudes to uh, get to work. My king broke their alliance with us. That's Bengal, but yeah. You hostile? Well, I guess that means we'll get rid of the access treaty. Oh, they did already. Good. That reduces our diplomatic relations by one. Delhi and Mao. I'm not remotely scared of Bengal. Their military tech is garbage. We win a siege. Good, good. Oh, I had to, we had to take a loan. We weren't good enough. See, a bit premature paying back those loans. Oh dear. Uh, I'm being chased. I'm being chased by a Ming army. Right, now. Yeah, we can do this. We can take him. Go on, my son. Oh, you want some sieges? Brilliant. 69%. Is that? That's probably not enough to get what I want. Uh, we're pretty damn close there. Actually, that's not what I want though. I want all this land. I want this land. Um There we go. They'll do it. They will do that piece off uh Is it worth returning some stuff to my vassals? For like a token amount? Almost certainly not. Right, what kind of aggressive expansion will that give us? Brunei will hate us and so will Makassar, Bengal. Hmm, Bengal will dislike that. Maybe they'll join the coalition. Yeah, let's do that. We've done it. Um, I'd say it's going to be under our patronage. For the mere low, low cost of... Overall, I think that was 400 Diplo points. Just to take it. Then we'll have a lot of problems annexing them. But no matter. I'd say give me the land. Boom! You dog. You don't like me, Ram. Oh my god, that's a lot of aggressive expansion. Sometimes it goes away when you annex and release, sometimes it doesn't. And that's going to be a problem. Oh well, they'll just be our... our little... vassal state for a, for a few decades. Whilst that aggressive expansion ticks down. Now, Bengal, you outraged? No. No, no. Brunei has left the coalition, you're scared of us. No, you're hot with less. Makassar has also left the coalition. Does anyone want to join the coalition? I mean, really. Anyone? Anyone at all? I mean, I'd love it if someone wanted to join. 
Really, it would make my day. So all that for Atse was a little extreme. But, um, we'll see. Bengal, you, uh, you got a lot of aggressive expansion with me. You sure? You sure you don't want to join the coalition? Nepal is, but they have a truce with us. Jaunpur is outraged with us. If we nick some land from Bengal, they would immediately join the coalition, but they are allied with the Timurids. Who still don't know about us. Shh, be very quiet. Don't, don't, don't tell the Timurids we exist. Anyway, all that's truce with Ming is up now. Like, they got Chagatai as a vassal. Good for them. Now, I can I my way into a war with Ming? <laughs> oh, excuse me. Well, if we've got nothing to do, we might as well punch Aita in the face and take their land, seeing as we have no overextension. Ah, I, I approve. Let's get rid of improving relations with Atse. What can we do with them? Well, we can get to plus 200 relations. And we can give them a gift and we can marry them. So that's 250. Uh, plus our current plus vassal on same relation is 310. So at the moment, if we maxed out all our relations bonuses, we would have a net uh, opinion modifier of them of plus 10. Not good. Uh, that means we need 180 and we get 30 a decade. 60 years! Up to is going to be our vassal for 60 years. Hmm, maybe I didn't think that through. A pretender's risen in Chiang Rai. You, uh, you any good? No. No, you're not very good. Kill him! Break his bones. Someone has disputed succession. Japan. We could try and personal unionize them. They would probably accept a marriage. Now. Let's send in the mercs first. Um, so we'll make our peasant normal soldiers wait a day or two. There we go. That means the mercs will take the brunt of the casualties. Ho ho ho! Come on, seriously, just die. Just die, sit down, go to sleep, shh, no more tears. Oh, they didn't get slaughtered. Well, now we're, seeing as we're in the area, hello, would you like to die? Should have let the mercs go first, sir. So. You will not escape in time. Oh, you might. Oh well. If you do, uh, I'll still kill you. Die, die, die. Now I must plan my next move. I feel my next move is going to involve. It's going to involve Bengal. Hello. They're allied with Delhi and Malwa. Now Malwa, let's take eight. Who hates Delhi? I suspect Mewa and Jaunpur. So they cannot really get to us. They kind of can. They get access through Nepal, actually. And Okay, so Delhi, Jaunpur, and Bengal. How much are they combined? Bengal, 14k. Delhi, 13. Jaunpur. No, and Malwa. 14, 13. Nine. So combine is quite a lot, but I'm pretty sure I can stack quite Bengal because their military tech so poor. Oh hello. Didn't see you there. We'll go to Chin. No, we'll go to somewhere where we can let's go to Koch. And actually we can get our vassals armies there too. Although they might get exiled. Uh is that it? We got any troops in Brunei? Mm, no. And our poor wet all vassal is You're in trouble, man. You're Buddhist and all your land is Sunni. You didn't take any ideas to help you tolerate anything. You do have tolerance of heathens of plus two from your national ideas though. So uh 
they probably won't be able to convert much. They can do Rao. At 0.9%. Wonderful. So they'll convert a bit for us, but we don't mind Sunni provinces. Your garrison strength of 2, so we can take one soldier. I think we might just do the Bengal War with Ayatollah on the boil, since they are so puny and so weak. So for Bengal, what we'd want is we'd want... Is this their capital? Yes, it is. We can't take it. Damn. Well, we'll take our claims then, I guess. Then I'll make Orissa join the coalition, but... Big deal. Um, we would like some kind of extra person to join the coalition so we can punch China in the face. So yeah, we take Dhaka, Silhet, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10... 18 base tax. If we took all our claims in Bengal, plus Ayutthaya, we would be overextended, but hopefully we'll be able to core Ayutthaya before that happens. Good time to end the episode here, it's been a while. Um, we'll claim a rival's province while we're at it. Um, yeah, so, thanks for watching. Uh, next episode, we will be punching Bengal in the face and getting some land from them. Uh, everything's good. War exhaustion's good, civility's good. Problem is our... Heh, Monic points aren't very good, but we can live with that. So, until then, um, thanks for watching and take care. Bye bye.